All right, so welcome back to another album review. This time we're going to be doing To Anywhere by Snow, the product. We haven't actually done a full-on um, review on video before of Snow, the product. I have actually done studies on her um, and doing album reviews um, throughout the entire time with her privately. So um, I mostly did that entirely. So... Um, this is going to be the first one I literally, like, release out of all of them. Now, um, normally, and this situation occurs, she normally gets at least around, around an eight, at least, I would probably say, say an 8.4 to a nine, to be specific, because a lot of times she doesn't really do too much on that, so I'm not going to literally, literally, like, assume that she does like everything above across the board because again as far as the category is concerned she is literally she is literally the top 15 um in the go conversation so again the situation is kind of different in that situation um but um on the other hand let's get straight into um topics of this because i think a lot of people need to understand the dynamics of this so um a lot of people need need to also realize as well that um i'm not going to be able to do this this is going to be a, a huge disclaimer um i'm going to be um numbering certain uh songs the reason i am is because i don't want to butcher um the native language native or the latin language so i don't want to do that so that's why um i'm going to make sure that um i'm only just gonna just number them <laughs> and not and I'll say the full name because otherwise I'm just going to have a huge issue. There are some um, songs in the album that are mostly English. Or, yeah, there are English. So, I'm not going to really, like, put that down on anybody. So, without a doubt, let's get straight into it. Okay, so what we're going to start off with is uh, There We Are. This is the intro. Um, a very good start to um to the album which is actually really really good so i gave it a 9.1 waves 100 percent they were really well with this this was actually actually a really really good song so i will 100 percent say um i'll definitely say that this definitely deserved a nine um song number three um very much another great song again uh this got another nine um not the performance on that because again um the majority of the album was mostly mostly um well mostly mostly um <laughs> mostly span spanish um fluent so it had a lot so i had i had to make sure that everything as far as translated into it it also had to make sense to actually add to the um all around song so of course um the album was containing so many of it of course i'm going to literally make sure that as i dissect the english i'm also going to dissect the english translation of it as well because the reason i have to is because no matter what the consequences are they're going to be at least um some things that have to be boundary because you will never know what they will say unless um it'll actually rhyme with the entire scheme and most importantly the entire album is whole in songs so so if they're making sense and all that stuff then that's perfectly fine and that actually and pretty much that actually made a lot more sense in this song as well um song number f at least song number four i think um yeah song number four uh this this one was actually phenomenal as well so i gave it a nine this was definitely another phenomenal one uh cash cash a hundred percent uh turn off song 100 percent, and i actually respect this one so um but besides all that it was a bit it was a bit basic on the other end so i gave it an 8.8 .8. not that bad so i wouldn't have a problem with that at all and then not today with him with her and gcj it was actually really 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 phenomenal how they actually did things about this part so um i did lighten up a little bit but i didn't give them a nine i gave them an 8.9 so um, it just wasn't enough. It just wasn't enough to cover up uh, the full nine scheme. So, um, Butter Part 2 is actually really, really good. 
the reason it is really, really good is because, again, it literally uh, took out a lot of changes um, over time, especially um, with the first song um, called Butter. It's not, not surprising that she decided to make a part two to it as well because it gives a different perspective from the last song, which, again, it actually helped out a lot. So I gave it a 9.1. Song number eight. <laughs> Um, so song number eight got a nine as well. Again, very well executed. Um, everything is already there. Translated all the way towards the um, translation, which she's very good at. She knows how to literally cave into this and know how to keep her flow in the same in place, keep it at pace, and she knows what she's doing. So that's what I really like to see. Um, and number and then there's out. Al- oh, sorry, song number nine. Song number nine, it actually did really, really well, surprisingly, which I didn't have any particular problems with. Um, so, again, another nine. Um, um, song number ten, ten got a nine as well. It was already, it was, again, very, very good. Got across the board. Then um, song number 11. And then I'm pretty sure all the way through, through the rest of the album as well, it got a full-on nine. Um, so because she executed everything really, really well. So, um, most of the songs did super, super well as far as the lyrical part is concerned. And then we round that up and then we have the lyrics at nine out of 10. Um, the artistry is at 9.1 and that the artistry was actually really, really well. Um, the way she represents everything thing and she takes us on the whole, uh, ride across her mind and what what her mindset is pretty much like for the majority of this. Um, it's very, very, very well, well written. And the creativity is a 9.3 is because it's the same one as from last time when she did uh, Halfway There, uh, part one, which was really, really, really well. Um, in th- that particular uh, album actually got a nine, a nine out of 10. So um, this is a huge increase for her. So um, I'm very, very impressed with this. And I'm really, really surprised at how she turned out with this one. So, but let's continue on. The re- rhythm patterns are pretty much the same from last time. The flows is the same from last time. And um, the figurative language is a bit skewed this time. It's a bit skewed this time. So I'm actually very, very impressed on how she actually um, literally represented the figurative language in this album, which was really, 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 really good. So I openly say that this is actually really, really good. Um, not a lot of them like responded on the same note, but I will say this, um, that this is just a minor increase to her, to her spot on, on the board because she, I think she recently just passed a big pun. Um, because again, due to longevity, um, people will tend to pass them, um, depending on what their longevity is going to be and how much they actually increase in skill. So, um, as far as anything, I will definitely say that she she has sustained a level of excellence for this for a long time. So I wouldn't be too surprised that that would be the case. So without a doubt, um, yeah, this album got a 9.2 out of 10. Um, it was a small increase. So um, hopefully it wasn't too keen on the scaling that was too much for y'all liking. Um, but let me know in the comments what you guys think. Uh, I really appreciate it y'all watching this video if you guys want to see more of these album reviews make sure to leave a like also hit that subscribe button if you want to do the channel this been said guys later Bye.